Hello, my beautiful friends. Today we're going to learn how to build a simple sentence in English. Are you ready? Well, come on then. Let's go. <gasps> sing along, sing along, sing along with Tony. If you want to build a simple sentence in any language, you need to learn a little bit about something called grammar. Grammar is like the rules that we use for building a sentence, and every language has grammar. The first rule that we're going to learn, my beautiful friends, is this. English is an SVO language. Boom! That's it. That's all you need to know. English is an SVO language. Easy, huh? Cool. Sweet. Bye. No, no, just joking. English is an SVO language. But what does this mean? Well, S stands for subject word, V stands for verb word, and O stands for object word. S-V-O, subject, verb, and object. This means that when we make a simple sentence in English, the subject word comes first, then the verb word, and then the object word. Pretty cool, huh? S-V-O, English is an S-V-O language. That's all I want you to remember. Cool, huh? But what's a subject, I hear you ask? Very good question, my little friend. Well, a subject is a word that tells us who or what is doing something in the sentence or who or what the sentence is about. Let's look at an example. Tony eats pizza. It's true. <laughs> In this sentence, who or what is the sentence about? Who or what is doing something? Hmm. Tony's doing something, isn't he? Yep. He's eating pizza. So if Tony is the one doing something in this sentence, then Tony is the subject word. Easy, huh? Cool. But what about a verb? A verb is a word that describes an action. Did you get that? A verb is a word that describes an action. It could be any kind of action. It could be a physical action, like dance. Or it could be a mental action, like to think. A verb is a word that describes an action. In our example sentence, what's the action? Hmm? What is it that Tony, our subject, is doing. He's eating, isn't he? Tony eats pizza. He's eating to eat. So that's our verb word, eats. From the verb to eat. I eat, you eat, he eats, she eats, Tony eats. Very good. Nice. So um, if the subject is Tony, the verb is to eat or eats, What's the object word? Yeah, you got it. The object word is always involved with the verb somehow. And what is it that is being eaten? What is it that Tony eats? That's pizza. Yes, pizza is our object word. Very good, very good. And that's it, my beautiful friends. That is how you build a simple sentence in English. S-V-O, subject followed by verb followed by the object. Let's build ourselves another simple sentence, all right? What do we need? A subject. Hmm. What could the subject be? Let's say the dog. I like dogs. Okay, cool. S-V-O. So subject is the dog. Hmm. V, verb. We need a verb, an action. What's a good action? Oh, yes. Sing. I like to sing. Singing is a great action. La, 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 la. I like to sing. I sing, you sing, he sings, she sings, the dog sings. Okay, so the subject is the dog. The verb is to sing and the object. Hmm, what can the object be? I know, a song. That makes good sense. Wicked. The dog sings a song. That's our simple sentence. The dog sings a song. 
Wow, we did it. You did it. Congratulations. You made a simple sentence in English. Well done. A round of applause. It's easy, isn't it? All you have to remember is English is an SVO language. Subject, then the verb, and then the object. Hey, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.